In this video, I will teach you how to make a 3D character in Blender. It will be a humanoid robot, and it will have a triangular head. Watch till the end. Use Ctrl R on your keyboard to make edge loops. These edge loops will shape your character's head. Add more edge loops if necessary. Now make the desired shape. Customize as you like. Press B on your keyboard. Add the mirror modifier Y axis because it can't be mirrored on the X axis. Now make the neck by extruding two faces. Before doing that, you need to apply the mirror. Because if you try to extrude these faces without applying the mirror modifier, it would look like it's not joined. Add subdivision surface. Make your model look beautiful. Add some cubes in order to make the structure of the character. Also, you can add the subdivision if you want. Customize the upper body part just as you like. Press the B key on the keyboard for box selection. I already mentioned it, but just to make sure that you know. Watch the 3D modeling process. Here's how I created the arms. Watch carefully. As I said before, the secret of my style is hiding in the subdivision surfaces and in Ctrl R on keyboard and the E key on the keyboard for extrusion. So, these are the steps I use every time when I make 3D models. Maybe somebody of you who's watching my video has already known for these shortcuts but I want to remind you on them. For the limbs I use the spare. It's the easiest way to make the limbs for me. The hand is the hardest model to make in Blender. Watch me create it. Sorry, I don't think it's the hardest. It's hard for me. With this little cube I'm trying to make the link, that will link the body and the arms. Now I need to mirror every object. This object becomes copied every time. To make the legs I will use the same strategy like for making the arms. Add a cube, then resize it to the size of your character, but make sure that it's the right size, like the arms. Like I did it for the arms, I will use the same spear, but for the knees. And also for the leg joint. I am still experimenting. 
I'm finishing the character right now. Just finishing the boots. This is the final phase of modeling. I do the sculpting part because I want to model the head of the character and make it recognizable. I also want to add the fingers. Add some eyes and finish. This is the final render of Cosmobot. I hope that you like it. Like, share and subscribe.